By day, I'm Simon Green. But by night... Betty Legs Diamond! Hi! Well, welcome to Newcastle, Betty. Thank you very much. How are you finding it? I'm cold at the moment, thus the fur coat. Is it um, real fur? <laughs> oh, no. It, oh, but probably some of it is, but um, don't worry. Died of a heart attack. <laughs> <laughs> now, tell me, who, who is Betty Legs Diamond? Um, Betty Legs Diamond is a uh, cabaret artist and uh, entertainer. Been on the circuit now for 30 years. Nearly. <laughs> Bang up to date to Boulevard. Right. How did this gig come about then? Um, I was I was just coming to the end of my contract at Funny Girls, and um, I got this phone call to ring this guy called John Little, a pure leisure in Newcastle. So I gave him a ring, and um, he said he's thinking of opening up a Funny Girls type bar in in Newcastle. I said, well, great. He said, what do you want? Me? I said, what do you want me to do? He said. Um, I need to, you know, your advice. How do I do it? What do I need, etc. So we had a few meetings, and um, basically, I, at first, I was going to um, tell him what he needed, put the show on, put the act in, and take a percentage, and walk away. But then he said, "Why don't you come up to Newcastle?" So I thought, sixteen years Blackpool. Yeah, I was. I've done my mm. my my stint. So I thought, why not um, um, come up to Newcastle and uh, oversee the whole thing myself and, and be in, in the show. The great thing about it at the moment is that we're getting a huge amount of feedback. It's brilliant. Everybody comes in, best £7 they've ever spent, best £20 or 30, depending where you, where you are in the building. It's the best night they've had for ages. And some have said the best night they've had out in Newcastle ever. So that, with that sort of feedback, now it's getting it out there to everybody else. It's, um, I suppose, it's again, it's those misconceptions, conception, conceptions of um, what it is. It's getting them through the door and to sit down and watch a top-rate, first-class cabaret show, and then go away and bring people in. You've got your own dancers. You've got well, Dan Rory. Cocktails, yeah. I think, and uh, yes, Rory, so, a brilliant find. Like, because cause when I when I said to Don, I said, he said, well, we need a, a Zoe character. Zoe was the compare. I said, well, well, you need somebody local. To to, to cause I I'm not from the area, so I I can't relate to local areas. If if a group come in from Jesmond or a group come in from I don't know, I don't know any other places at the moment. Um, Gateshead, I need to know. Um, points about them and and to, to use references it's great to use references with local people to, to bring them into the show and uh, he's perfect for that so I said to John we needed someone in local and Rory fitted the bill and uh, a brilliant brilliant compound. Mm -hmm.